Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us on today's video. I'm uh, carrying around uh, the two hanging tags we post on the windows of the car. Only reason I'm doing that is uh, because there are so many items and so much build that's gone into this car that, uh, that is impossible for me to even remember. So, and on top of it, uh, I don't even have everything listed here. We have a beautiful folder. This car is professionally built. Uh, not built in a, in a garage, not that uh, people aren't capable of that, but this is what this guy does for a living uh, to the tune of almost $150,000. The good news and the bad news. The bad news is it was built to uh, enter Hot Rod's world's fastest streetcar competition. And uh, I guess some weather or something like that happened and they had to postpone it. So the guy spent all his time and money building it for that and then couldn't make the event because something else came up uh, that was uh, a little bigger than that. So uh, the truth of the matter is this car has been built. It's been driven just a little bit. And it's actually, uh, I don't even think, gone down the quarter mile yet. It is NHRA certified. Um, as we walk around this car, it is uh, well built. It's very expensive parts. I mean, even down to the exhaust system alone, it was almost $4,000. It was custom bent. I've never seen tubes this big uh, on a street car before. But uh, as you look around, man, this thing is top of the line from the interior to the outside, to the engine compartment, to the guts of the motor. Um, and how about we start with, uh, with body and paint? So you have a complete one-piece front end. All that comes off uh, to service the car if you want to. Uh, the hood comes off too, held on with pins. Zeus fasteners. As we look around, we have four-wheel Wheelwood disc brakes. This car is designed to drive and operate in 100-degree temperature, idle all day, and be spectacular. Those are street tires on the back with tread on them. It comes with a parachute. It comes with a Halon fire system. All of that is built into the car. You put gas in the back, just like uh, a regular car. You get in, you turn it on, and it drives. And it's so easy to drive. I was so surprised uh, uh, how easy this car is to drive down the street. I thought for sure that I would be getting in an animal that would scare me. Now, the interesting thing about it, too, is this is set up right now uh, with, the, uh, with the larger pulley, uh, so it's 700 horsepower. This engine is built to be 1,000 horsepower and a reliable 1,000 horsepower. All the internals inside this engine, top of line, the best you could buy. Everything's built professionally, and let's uh, keep rolling around the, the car and check that out. I love to talk about body and paint and things like that and show the uh, quality of what goes in there. Check that out. You can read that whole sticker in there, 69 Camaro, Pro Street Z28. This is dressed up really, really nicely. Great wheels, great tires. The big brakes are poking through. There's no mistaking what this car is designed to do. As we run down the list of, uh, of items on the car, as a matter of fact, I'll tell you what I'll do. Let me run down a couple of the items on the car for you. And then as we roll around the car, uh, you can see those items and, uh, and they're in the back of your mind going, oh, okay, I wanna see this, I wanna see that. Uh, the engine in here, 540 cubic inch uh, Merlin V8, dart heads, all steel guts inside, okay? Twin Holly 1050s dominators. And this right here, once I open the hood, is the largest blower I've ever seen on a car. It's a 1471 blower. Uh, I think those typically I uh, have those on uh, airplanes. I'm just kidding, but anyway, you know how big it is. The Turbo 400 Trans, pro build from the, the tip to the tail shaft, everything in it heavy duty, uh, ready to go. And then uh, uh, instead of going with a 12 bolt or a Ford 9 inch, we have a serious Dana rear end here, tied in, four link. You need to see the underneath of this car. Uh, it's so well built back there on top of it. Not only is it well built, it's uh, the exhaust when it comes by it, <laughs> just looks so ridiculous from behind. I get all excited to talk about this car because that's so cool. Um, to be comfortable, and we'll move into the interior in just a second. So let me take the hood off and uh, let's take a peek at that. You know, we talked about reliability, streetability, and all the uh, details that go in that. A complete different front end on this car with rack and pinion steering, tubular control arms, nice motor mount plates, steering shaft goes through, look at the size of the radiator. It takes up the whole engine compartment. It's nice and deep. It's got two big fans on it. This car was designed to uh, run well. And check out some of this stuff. Like you see all the braided fittings, everything. None of the cheap cover stuff. This is really all plumbed fitting. Radiator, plumbed. Look at how nice this is. Blower, plumbed. Look how tidy and detailed everything is. Alternators down low. It's nice and clean in here. It's just beautifully done. Let's take a peek inside for a second. Also, one other thing too, they put foam pads underneath this hood, so if you went somewhere, easy to take off, you put it right on the roof, you don't have to worry about getting stepped on. You know what, keep in mind guys, they've spent a lot of money on this car and it's never really been driven. It's the kind of car you would build for yourself, 
but it's less than half price. Let's check out the inside. Beautifully done interior. Check this out. All sport bucket seats with great uh, support. Custom center console. This car has power windows. It has a full cage in it in here. Parachute. Halon fire system. Look at the detail in the back. It's a $12,000 interior this vehicle is done to. Full custom dash. It's got a billet steering column with tilt wheel. All your auto meter gauges. Just beautifully done, beautifully done. Liquid filled auto meter gauges over here. As we wander around this car, you know, this car gets better and better the more you look at it. Some cars get worse as the more you look at them. This car gets better. Real bead lock wheels. Tire is, uh, is locked right on there. Everything is heavy duty back here. Come back here, check this out. Beautifully built spoiler. The parachute here, I love this. What a great touch. Remove before flight. And you'd be surprised, man. This car is just so easy to drive. It just drives down the street like a regular car. But God forbid you, uh, you know, you're not paying attention and going straight because it can get a little squirrely on you. But it does, uh, it does run cool. We already know it's very fast and uh, it's really great to look at. But let's check out some of the stuff underneath I get so excited about. This is the stuff that not everybody gets to see. I want you to see this exhaust. This is four inch custom bent exhaust. Even the bottom of the exhaust, because the car was low, they were cut off and then plates were welded on so it wouldn't scrape. Fully adjustable rear suspension. Look at that. Look at the size of the tires in there. You can set the suspension for, uh, for dampening, compression settings. This is one wicked Z28. Anyway, uh, how about I start it for you and let's uh, hear what she sounds like. Fuel pumps and start. Car comes with a nice tool in the glove box. Go ahead and I'm just putting on the hood. To put, take the hood on and off takes just about a minute. Everything lines up nicely. All the Zeus fasteners are very nice. Great body and paint, great car, awesome, awesome interior, killer motor, rack and pinion steering, four wheel disc brakes. Enough about me talking about this car, I mean just look at this thing, it's the most menacing uh, pro street car we have ever had. It's uh, not only beautiful, but it's ugly. You know, the beaded wheels, the giant carbs sticking out of the hood. Uh, I'm telling you man, if you ever wanted a really cool car and you wanted to buy it for half price, uh, this is the way to go. Anyway, cool car, super fast, easy to drive. 700 to 1,000 horsepower. Call us 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about it.